Hello world, this is Hacker Triple O Seven, and today I'll be doing a video program review on uh, VLC 2.0. That's a great program. They uh, they did a lot, lot of new features, um, which I'll be showing you guys in a minute. Now I downloaded this awesome program. Uh, I'll have a link in the description to right here, and when you open it, it will give you a four second countdown and you can have the uh, setup file so or the download file sorry so just put it into your download section whatever you gotta do download it and we'll have it downloading so uh, some of the new features of the new program are uh, here we have here I've written them down um, it's rewritten video output core and modules allowing uh, sub picture blending in GPU multi thread decoding for uh, High quality 264, um, MPG, and XFID and WebM. Completely new single video interface. And as you see, some more stuff here. So they've really taken the time to have rewritten some of this codec, um, fix the program up, and basically improve it. So uh, here I'll be showing you guys this, the new, new program. So you have obviously the English language. Um, next next and now you have uh, the options so you can go through and you can go full which is everything minimum which is just the basic stuff or recommended so what you think what it thinks we think you should do um, I'm just to do all of them so you can go full hit next obviously right there and we extract it so they just they just released this about uh, three days ago. Uh, I never had time to actually releasing a video on it, so I decided to make one today, as I had a little bit of time on my hand. So we're almost finishing up here, just extracting the uh, files to the installation folder. A little command prompt. Now, if you guys ever have any. Uh, video suggestions or um, questions or anything like that, I, I'd love to make a video on a question or a possible new program coming up or a theme um, as I did that on my, on my last theme review. So once it's done obviously you can it will have a run VLC media player 2.0 already um, selected. You can also click show readme if you want and you can finish. This will open them up. So here we have the README for it. Um, it's an open source media player and multimedia engine. So it has the links, um, some extra source code content if you want to use that stuff if you're a developer, obviously. Alright, so here we go. We have the program. Um, clean interface, you know, we got the standard cone, we got the play buttons at the bottom, we got the uh, volume control so you can actually increase the uh, volume past its normal um, streamline I guess you could say uh, playback, we have the audio, video, tools I'll go to preferences to show you guys so in here we have, um, we have you can use a custom skin um, so, and you have just options here so for um, privacy network interaction, you can actually download the album art, which you have options here. So menu download, when track is playing, or as soon as the track is actually added, it will automatically download it, which is the already suggested su suggestion. Audio, you can actually disable audio if you want. Um, you can do headphone surround sound, whatever you want. Virtualization. Video, office video, and there's just some simple options, you know, codecs if you, um, whatever you want to do with that. So, so it's a pretty cool program. Um, for custom, oh, wrong one. For custom interface, this is what we got right here. So you can actually drag stuff around. So you can put above the video if you want it to be, um, and then it'll go up there. 
which actually isn't a bad idea for me. You can drag stuff in there, drop them out. Um, it's really simple to use. You know, you can just drag stuff, drop them using right here line line one, line two. So it's pretty it's pretty okay. You can um, you set profile so you can close and it changes the bars. So it's a pretty cool program. Uh, again, you can put disks, network stream, capture device, advanced opening options, and of course, I'll play a little video here just to show you guys exactly. So I'm gonna start play. A little uh, in here you go. So now this is my intro, obviously. So as I saw down the bottom right here, we had the uh, the actual name of the video. So that's one of the things about uh, VLCs. It always names the has the name of the video at the bottom. So besides that, though, it's a pretty awesome program. I uh, suggest checking it out. Um, a lot of some people actually think that VLC is better than Windows Media Player. Um, it's fast opening. You know, it's very similar to Windows Media Player. For basic standard users, I suggest Windows Media Player. But if you're more, uh, you know, you want to see if the grass is green on the other side, you may want to check this program out. Program's pretty awesome. Um, again, VLC Media Player 2.0 video review. And that's what it for this video. Uh, I'll have a download link in the description below. Besides that, have a nice day. This is Dr. Triple 7, and I'm signing off.